New studies show that taking large doses of antioxidants can help with irritable bowel disease like Crohn's, colitis, IBS, all those things. This is really groundbreaking. Brand new study, 2024. Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist, get healthy now. Hi, Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist and Health and Wellness Instructor. And let's get you healthy. We can do it. If you like what I do, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please tell other people. Let's get everybody healthy. So brand new studies show that taking large doses of particular antioxidants, and I'll talk about that at the end, the doses and what I recommend, can help with Crohn's and also IBS and IBD and colitis and all these different diseases in general. And this is very amazing because so many people suffer with this and it's not good. Because people were eating a lot of processed food and they get pathogens into their system, also they end up breaking down the lining of their gut and then the inflammation takes over and that leads to one of these diseases. And that's very painful. Then we get the cytokines going and we end up with pain and it's a, a long process of recovering and the tri typical treatments of steroids and different things like that are not good for the body, that's for sure. But we can get back to normal. To get us started in the first place, you know, the white blood cells get overactivated and they start breaking down the mucosal lining. And they're just trying to, to help us, but, uh, you know, things go kind of awry. Taking antioxidants prevents the breakdown of the mucosal area, the you know, the mucus lining of the gut itself, so we don't end up with, you know, gut disease. So this is super important. Which antioxidants? Well, there's a lot, and they really, there's a huge amount of antioxidants. One of my favorites is turmeric or carusamin, which is the active ingredient, and taking about 1,000, 1,200 to 1,400 milligrams daily really helps in a big way. Also, grapeseed extract is an inexpensive antioxidant that happens to be 24,000 milligrams every day. That really does a great job also, and really, like I said, pretty cheap compared to some of the others. One of my favorites is berberine. Berberine is amazing, huge amount of uses for this, and taking 1,200 milligrams every day really does a great job also. Another one is lutilinol. Lutilinol is not lutein, that's different. Lutilinol is an antioxidant which actually helps your brain also. And taking 100 milligrams daily really does help also. Also, flaxseed oil, taking 1400 milligrams daily is very important. Also, green tea extracts, 1200 milligrams daily. Uh, quercetin, powerful antioxidant, I recommend it just about all my clients, 500 milligrams daily, and Reveratrol, you know, the anti-aging agent, well, really does a great job. Taking a 1,000 milligrams daily really helps. Also, one of my favorites also is liposomal glutathione. This is one of the most important antioxidants in, whole your, in your whole body, and uh, they vary in how much antioxidants they have in them. Uh, this one here is taking about a thousand milligrams every day. And I'm telling you, this is the most powerful antioxidant, most prevalent antioxidant in your whole body. Also for some people who get along with ginger, 500 milligrams of ginger really helps also. Also eating cruciferous vegetables, those sulfonamides really do help, and they're an antioxidant agent also, and eating a lot of cruciferous vegetables are really, really, really and important. there's a huge amount of other, you know, antioxidants that a person can take, and I could go on for hours, but these are some of the ones I recommend, and taking them every day, and also getting on a good diet, getting on a whole foods, plant-based diet, getting away from processed food, 
Uh, also, you know, eating animal products creates the bad bacteria uh, overgrowth, which is not good, and you end up with SIBO. So eating a whole foods, plant-based diet, and eating lots of fiber, you know, like brown rice and oatmeal and things like that. Uh, also fruits and vegetables and lots of beans. Those are important. And studies show that those who eat a whole foods, plant-based diet have less problems of having any kind of gut issue in general. I'll put a list in the first comment of a few of the antioxidants and the dosages so you don't have to go back through this all the time. So there you go. Antioxidants can help with gut disease. Take your antioxidants. If you have something going on, give me a call at 831-869-9119. 831-869-9119. I'm pretty much inexpensive compared, you know, just to go see a physician's assistant in New York. You know what it costs? Almost $700 for 15 minutes. Amazing. Uh, I get the people who doctors throw away and they say that you have liver disease, there's nothing I can do, and uh, get your, you know, things in order. And when I reverse that. And so what gets you healthy and gets you on the right track of being healthy the rest of your life and no reason to suffer? 831-869-9119. So remember God, remember I love you. And if you have something going on in your life and it's terrible, you know, call Archangel Michael to come and protect you and come and do battle with that which is evil. I'm telling you, there is no power greater other than God to help you and be with you than that archangel Michael with a sword. I love you.